What's up, Solo Sportsters? I'm here today, as you can see, at the iconic US Open with Arthur Ashe Stadium behind me to test out the new Diadem Elevate Racket. We got their tennis balls, we got their racket, we're gonna hit it on court, so stay tuned. Diadem Elevate 98 FS is a 98 square inch beam, as you can tell from the name, with an unstrung weight of 305 grams, equating to 10.8 ounces, a swing weight of 310, which makes it somewhat balanced or four points head light, a stiffness of 64, a string pattern of 16 mains and 20 crosses, a constant thin beam of 21.5 millimeters. It is a standard 27 inches long, comes in grip sizes one through four, has the diadem vintage feel hybrid as a grip, and comes in a really sharp teal and black colorway cosmetic. In this new FS iteration, Diadem features a flex stabilization system, which is a rib structure construction in the frame strategically placed to create power, stability, and feel. You sense this from the very first ball you hit as the frame is very firm and resilient despite the soft flex reading. Taking balls early felt strong as the racket carried through impact. In our all Diadem court test, we also used their signature string, Solstice Power, which I felt added to the setup in intensifying the crispness. Big hitters with fast swings will appreciate the high density foam and HMT carbon used in the racket, making it feel like you can create as much pace as possible, as well as dealing with any pace your opponent throws at you. Elevate 98 FS plays well off court and was precise at net. The 16 by 20 pattern was comfortable to pocket on the volley, yet give that stick to clear the court and finish points. I did find the sweet spot very hard to find on most of my shots, however. I like to hit my backhand higher on the racket, and for my spin shots I go a little bit more side to side, which felt better on this frame. It was a bit of a trade-off for the crisp solid feel and not being as plush as other rackets. on how I can command the court with this standard weight racket. You get the serve pop and plow through feel of a heavier 315 plus gram setup, but this racket is much less cumbersome. I was comfortable stepping inside the baseline or even hanging back by the screens in my rallies. Overall, this racket had many positives, but I felt it was quite demanding for the range. High-end tournament players with a 4.0 or higher rating looking for control in an all-court game with either a one- or two-handed backhand will love this racket. If you like the Babolat Pure Strike 18x20, Head Gravity MP, Technifiber TF40 305 18x20, Yonix Decor Pro 97, or Wilson Blade 98 18x20 but want that manual drive stick shift experience then get this racket in your hands and take control of your game. Always fun playing on these incredible US Open courts. I hope you enjoyed the video. We've got more reviews for you that we're going to be suggesting soon and if you want to be the first one to see any of our videos be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you.